Hi, Optical Friends. This is Jen Trachtenberg. I wanted to share some tips as we're all thinking about what coming back to work might look like and what the impact will be on our team and our staff. I think it's incredibly important for us to remember as leaders that folks are looking to us for help to navigate change. And there is so much change and chaos amongst us. One of the most important things that you can do is to provide tangible, direct input on how to use your time. In many cases, we're running with a much leaner team and they need to really understand how to prioritize, what things are, are need to do as opposed to would like to do, how to organize their day. They look to leadership for that. And if we can help them to do it, it creates tremendous efficiency and will really make work more enjoyable. In addition, we probably want to think about what cross training is necessary. In many cases, it may be that individuals need um, to learn new skills and, and get that upskilling opportunity. It may be that there are tasks we no longer are going to do or we need to ask others to cover for. So we want to think about what that training plan is going to look like and who will most um, be supportive and beneficial to throw into the game so that they're able to help our operation. Um, thirdly, we should really be thinking about having a mechanism in place to collect feedback. That means the person who's doing the job sees it most closely and may observe things or, or be able to call out details that are not as obvious to you or I um, looking at it from a leadership perspective. Having that mechanism in place allows us to not lose out because of our own blind spots and allows them to feel a sense of ownership and buy-in so that their great ideas can bubble up. And finally, and most importantly, let's always remember the importance of feedback. Giving individuals feedback regularly helps them to know that you're there and you're coaching. It's not about correction. It's really about giving that individual the ability to see that we're invested in them and we want them to play at their very best game. So I hope these tips are helpful and that you're able to employ them into your own practice. And I wish you a great day ahead. Thanks so much.